Hi. 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 <laughs> Come on in. As you can see, I am in my alternate world today in my other corner. Uh, I'm really getting used to this clam chair. I don't think I've used it all as as much in the past as I have the past few days since it's been so hot outside, but it's really comfortable. Um, so anyway, guess what I've got for you today? A massive bag of jewelry and accessories. I have 19 rings, seven sets of earrings, 12 pins or brooches, whatever you want to call them, and 11 other items, a total of 49 pieces. And we're going to go through all of these today. For those of you who are new to my alternate corner, my name is Connie, and I go by Connie's Little Corner. Typically, I'm out on the lanai, but we are sitting at 118 degrees right now here in the Phoenix, um, greater Phoenix area. Too hot, too dangerous to sit outside, so I hope you don't mind me being inside. I do have my Timu hat on. I've got my Timu watch band. I've got a Timu ring and a Timu ring and my Timu dragonfly shirt. There you go. My Timu dragonfly shirt fits like a charm. Absolutely love it. Love Timu. And I have some good news. Don't fast forward. Wait. Timu has decided that even though I'm a new um, shopper or I don't have like 10,000 or 20,000 subscribers, they've been very happy with what they've seen and they have invited me to participate in their sponsored program, uh, which basically means as an influencer, they will provide me seed money, of course, a very small amount to start with. And as my subscribers grow and my followers grow um, and I do more of these videos, they will increase my seed money exponentially. So before I forget everything, please, 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 like and subscribe. Help me grow because I really do want to um, be affiliated a little bit more so with Timu. And what they've also told me is right now, all new users are going to get 50% off your first order. So below in the description box, you will see my link. Go on your phone. Use that link or go on your computer, lose that link, use that link, download the app. It's free, no charge. No, it's not spam. This is real. Check out my other videos and check out everybody else. But above all else, please, please, please smash that subscribe button. The more I am sponsored by Timu means the more variety I can bring to you guys. Larger items, more pricey items that under my own budget, I might not be able to afford. So let's do this together. When I hit 100 subscribers, everyone who is subscribed, all right, I will let you know we are going to have a drawing for a value of up to $50 in custom made jewelry. I do have my own jewelry business and you will get a choice. It will be anything from earrings, necklaces, pendants, um, bracelets, charm bracelets, charms, a variety of sets. It'll equal $50, and I will, you and I will work together for you to actually personally choose your gifts. So come on, let's get to 100 subscribers. And in the meantime, let's get to this bat, okay? Um, I had this somewhat sorted, but I don't know if that's really going to do any good because there's just so much in it. All right, let's see where I'm going to start. Bear with me a second. Oh, excuse me, Levi. One of my pit bulls is laying at my feet because he doesn't want to miss a trick. <laughs> All right, I got to push this back a little bit. We're going to start with some of the accessories as opposed to the actual jewelry, jewelry, but we'll get there. There's a lot. All right, so the very first thing I have, and I've never bought them before, is a pair of sunglasses. Um, these are purple. I will take them out of the bag. They cost me a dollar fifty-two, and I wanted sunglasses that would fit over what I wear because these are prescription, and I didn't want to have to keep changing. So I got these. Now, if you can see, they're purple. They've got a nice gold design on the side. All right. Very lightweight. Yes, they're plastic, but you know what? They're very solid. So let's see what happens if I put them on over my own glasses. Wow, these are dark. Oh, I like them. What do you think? I like them. For under $2? Yeah, hello. You can't even see the band of my regular glasses on the side. That's really cool. 
and I don't even see the bar of my glasses right here. All I see is the sunglasses. So, wow. Okay, these are seriously dark, and I'm seriously happy with these. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, next item. So far, so good, right? This is going to be a long video, so I hope you've got some hydration, you've got a snack, you're sitting somewhere where you're comfortable in the air conditioning, hopefully. This was $1.77, and these are a pair of glasses for my dog, all right? Aren't these the cutest little goggles you've ever seen? They come with the ear holes, so it goes over the ears and then around the back of their heads. This one is actually for my pit mix, for my girl. Um, my guy has a pair of sunglasses already that look like aviator glasses. So these are for Sadie. These will be her glasses. And I'm really happy with these. Um, I haven't tried them on her face yet, but I can try them on her face later. Maybe post a picture if you'd like to see her, <laughs> excuse me, in her glasses. Just let me know. Okay. At originally, I can't even read what I wrote. 99 cents with a 17 cent price adjustment, 82 cents each for these bands. I will open one of them up for you. They're both the same, just different colors. One's in bright red, one's in black. Um, I wanted to try these because normally I cut my own leather and I put the snaps on my own leather when I make these kind of bracelets. But these are divided bracelets. Can you see how they have multiple strands? All right, what I'm going to do on these is each one of these strips will have a single strip of bling on it. And my idea with this black one is to um, put on it bling that looks almost like a leopard pattern or possibly even a zebra pattern um, on each of these so that when it spreads out, you'll have a lot of bling. On the red one, I'm not sure what I'll do with the red one. I might make an animal pattern or just lots of other bling i don't know but for the price can't complain uh 82 cents each also below before i forget below in the description you will see an explanation or instructions whatever you want to call it details on how to request your own price adjustments if you haven't heard about them now please check out below basically it's team who's promise of the lowest price guarantee so anything that you have paid for Within the past 30 days, even if it's already delivered or even if it hasn't been shipped yet, if you've paid for it in the past 30 days and the price goes down from what you pay, you'll get a price adjustment for the difference. So go get it. It'll get you lots of credits on your account. All right. This was $1.17. All right. And this is another pair of sunglasses, but this is for my mom. And she actually picked these out. My mom is 94. Right. And she's doing great. But all of a sudden now, because she's seen me wear my sunglasses, she wanted. So she picked these out. She liked the shape of them, how they're kind of flat on the top and very kind of like almost like a Harry Potter type shape on the bottom, almost the rounded. These are just plain beige, a little ivory. They're very lightweight. But for the cost, for $1.17, I don't worry if she breaks them, if she loses them, it doesn't matter. Um, either way, I'm sure she'll enjoy them. So that'll be a surprise for her because she... She picked them out, but she doesn't know that they have arrived. Okay, next item. There's not too much in this accessory type bag, but there's enough. This was 87 cents, 87 cents. And there are six in here. Can you see the different colors? Let me turn it this way. So you've got pink, purple, peach or orange, yellow, blue, and white. And what these are, these are little tiny... They look like macaroons, right? But they're individually wrapped. <laughs> you would think they were candy, but I am going to open up one of them so you can see what it's all about. It's a little macaroon, all right? Literally looks like a little cookie. Looks like the little macaroon, all right? I don't like this glare. I'm getting a terrible glare from that thing again. Uh-oh, that's not good. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Got to move this over. Get my hand out of the way. Hold on. Okay. That's, oh, that's so much better. All right. So it's a little macaroon. It just looks like a little tiny cookie. Can you see that? But it opens. I can get them open. There we go. It just pops open. It's big enough to hold a ring 
or a small pair of post earrings. Um, it might even hold like a, a tiny, if it's just a thin chain or something that you don't want to lose. You can put a myriad of things in here, but I thought these are absolutely adorable. Um, they do have like a little latch. Can you see this little, whatever you want to call it, like a little bump, little knobby there. And then there's a little knob in here where it will fit into. So when you push them together, it makes it go together nice and tight. All right, so there's six of these. These I will use as gifts in my jewelry business so that when I do wrap something up for somebody, they have a nice little container. Um, I have gift bags too, and I'll just drop that into a gift bag. So I'd like to do a little something extra. All right, $1.52 each. I don't think I got a price adjustment on these, but these are watch bands like what I'm wearing. All right, they're the same, same style, exact same thing, just different colors. When I bought this and about eight others, they were $1.68, and I got a price adjustment on them. These are still at $1.52, but I will show these to you. Absolutely love, love, love these. The reason I like these so much is, as you can see on this, you see there's no tail. It goes through a hole here, and it sits up against, see it inside? There's the tail. It's inside against your wrist. So that means, yes, you do have to put it like one notch looser than what you would, but it hides so it doesn't get caught on anything. With me being left-handed and wearing my watch on my left hand, trust me when I say it got caught a lot. So this is a beautiful dark shade of teal. It actually turquoise. It almost <laughs> matches my nails. Don't look at my nails. They're so overgrown. I think I'll do them tonight. Pick a different color. But these are really nice. This particular one, the buckle matches. All right, these are very soft silicone. And this other one is different. It's not a royal blue and it's not a navy blue. It's almost like um, almost like a purplish blue, but it's it's a different shade of blue. I like it. Maybe a dark periwinkle. I don't know how I would describe it. But again, it's got the buckle that matches, right? And these will go in the case that you might have seen in my last video. So that's it for that. All right. Not too many more things in here. Hair clip. All right. Very blingy hair clip. This was 88 cents. If you can see that, 88 cents. Ah, la, 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 la. Yes, I make funny noises, don't I? I don't know. I love music. I have music in my head. This is all blinged out. Look at this. All blinged out. See how it's got the extra teeth on the inside? Can you see this row of teeth right there? That's the way it grabs from the inside. So you pull your hair up in a ponytail like mine is now. This goes on the bottom. You come up from under the ponytail so that when you have it wrapped around the ponytail, this is what you see, that you don't actually see this clip. This is what you see. So I just fell in love with this. And for the price... Look at that. There's no way that I could make anything like this in my business as cheap as I just moved it on Timu. So I'm happy with that. This was also 88 cents. Let's see if I can get this open. I did not bring my fancy little cutter with me. I think it's sitting over there on the table. But I think I can do this without it. I hope. Oh, phooey. I don't think I can. Hold on a second. Well, let me go get my cutter. Okay, got it. Um, sorry, it took me so long. That was like a nanosecond, right? Remember this little guy? Love him. All right, let's get sliced into this. Get this open. There we go. All right, so again, 80 cents for this. This is another hair piece. Now, they actually have earrings to match this, but I'm not a girl that likes to do matchy-matchy. As you can tell, I have different colored earrings on than what my hat and my blouse are, but it all coordinates. So I don't do the match-match thing. But anyway, I thought this was really sweet. It's just got the black elastic band, and it's got a very southwestern type design to it with a little bit of faux turquoise on it. It's pretty solid. It's not tinny at all. It's really solid. So I do like that, and I think that would be great on the top of a ponytail. Nice little ponytail holder. All right. Where are we at next? This is... I have a bag in a bag in a bag. So I pulled this bag out of the bigger bag. Now I have another bag. Hold on. <laughs> Come on. I have another bag inside this bag. <laughs> I have too many bags. Oh, what did I just find here? Okay. Oh, this is another watch band. 
I didn't realize I had three of these. I thought I only had two. Okay. This one is just basic black. It's about as black as you can get. Midnight black. Also on this one, the buckle is still the same. All right. This is for my Samsung watch. All right, for my smart watch. Um, this is a 20 millimeter connection here, and they also have it in 22. These bands that I'm showing you are not compatible with an Apple watch. However, Apple watches on Timu have an awful lot of bands available to them, more so than what I can find for my watch. A little jealous, actually. All right, let's get into the pins. This entire little bag is pins. And how many pins do we have? Let me check the list. We have, oh, we only have a dozen pins. That's not too bad. <laughs> if I can get them all out and not lose any of them. All right, there we go. Okay. No real rhyme or reason for any of these other than I thought they were just absolutely adorable and I decided that I wanted to have them. All right, so this one was 53 cents. And for 53 cents, it is a little pineapple, but it's a pineapple hut. It's a regular, it's a regular pin, like a Titac type of pin. All right. But this is a little pineapple hut. You see that? Look at that. Isn't that adorable? I don't know why I like it, but I thought it would look good on either my green hat or my orange hat or even stand out on my black hat come Halloween. But yeah, I live in the tropics, kind of. So pineapple is a good thing. Though I don't like to eat pineapple. All right, this one was 79 cents. I had a nine cent price adjustment on it, so I paid 70 cents for this. By the way, all these pens I'm pretty sure are under a dollar. So you can imagine if I have 11 pins that I, I didn't even spend $10 on these pins actually. Oh, this one's got a bag in a bag. Okay, so this one, <laughs> I'm a music lover, but I'm also, a child of the 50s. I was a teenager in the 60s. Um, and I just fell in love with this little antique looking, and, and I got to hold it this way, this little brooch that looks like an old, old record player, the ones that used to come in the cases. And this is the first record player I ever had looked like this. All right, so I had to get this pin. Absolutely fell in love. I thought it was adorable. Great quality, great detail on it too. I really like that. Okay, next. 98 cents with a 10 cent price adjustment. 88 cents for this little baby. I should just slice all these open and not bother to try to open them the other way, but all right, let's get into them. This one. I've said to a few people, when I saw this pin, I'm like, you know what? This this means a lot to me. This pin says, be the person that your dog thinks you are. All right. And my dogs love me unconditionally, so I must be some sort of a good dog mama. But the, I love what it says. It just says, be the person that your dogs think you are. And I think that applies to everybody whether you have a dog, a cat, kids, be the person that everybody thinks that you are. Be that real person. 89 cents. This was just a cute little one. I actually got this from my mom. All right. So I'm not keeping this one. But this one says Witch's Brew on it. This brooch says Witch's Brew. And that's what we used to call some stuff that my mother would make when I was growing up. So we couldn't use the B word, of course, to your mother. You never use the B word. That would be disrespectful. She would have knocked me into next week. And as it is, she knocked me into next week so far. I'm actually a lot younger than I look. <laughs> she hit me so many times. Uh, she was strict disciplinary. But which is brew? That's for mama. And uh, I know she's going to love that when she sees this. She'll, if she remembers, because she does have Alzheimer's. But if she remembers, she'll get a kick out of that one, I'm sure. All right, this next one was, what was this one? Oh, 68 cents, 68 cents. Sometimes I can't even read my own writing. Please let me know if I'm going too fast or too slow or talking too much. Yes, I do talk a lot. Um, I do that for several reasons, not one of which is not to hear myself talk, it's to just give you information. So everybody says this all the time, so I had to get it in a hat pin, and it just says OMG with an exclamation point. OMG. Pretty cool, huh? 
I like that. The thing that I love about these pins too is that they're so easy to put on my baseball caps that I can just um, either put them on a specific hat, you know, make them like designated to a certain hat or put them on as I choose to put them on, mix and match them. All right, so this was 88 cents, excuse me, 58 cents. And I had a 15 cent price reduction. So 43 cents for this particular pen. Told you I can't read my own writing. 43 cents. And this one says, hell, admit one. There we go. See that? Hell, it's your ticket to hell. So I figure my ticket's been bought and paid for over the years. I might as well have to proof. So there's my ticket to hell. Oh, some of these are really weird. Okay, $1.52 for this one. This one really spoke to me and the person that I am and the things that I do. Um, if you're of my generation, you should be familiar with Rosie the Riveter. If you were born before Baby Boomers, then you're definitely familiar with Rosie the Riveter. And if you had parents that kept you informed, even if you're X generation or Generation X, whatever they call it, everybody should know. Every woman should know about Rosie the Riveter. She was a force to be reckoned with. And this pin has Rosie and it says, be your best self. Be your best self. Absolutely love that. And that's me when I'm working around the house. Sleeves rolled up, hair up, trying to be my best self. All right, 71 cents. Now, I had bought this from mom. Um, I think you might have seen it at my last jewelry haul. But I bought it in black for her because she drinks her coffee black. I do not drink my coffee black. Um, but I am strong like my coffee. Can you see that? Let's find a better way to do it. There we go. Strong like my coffee. Absolutely love that. It's just a little red, little red coffee cup. Strong like my coffee. It's a good size. It's about an inch. So it's not really tiny. It's a pretty good size. But I like that. That'll go on one of my hats for sure. All right. 71 cents. <laughs> oh, come on. Open up. When I saw this, this reminded me of Marvin the Martian, um, the cartoon. Again, that's my generational thing. I don't know if anybody else is of that genre, genre, but it's not Marvin the Martian, but that's just what it reminded me of with the bug eyes and the way it is. And it says, still pen, guy holding the universe up, it says, stronger than you think. Stronger than you think. And that's me. Most people uh, make the mistake of thinking that I, just because I'm a older woman, that I'm not strong. They would be very mistaken. <laughs> 98 cents with a 15 cent price adjustment. So I paid 83 cents for this one. Only one more pin, hang in there, and then we're going to get to the other stuff. Um, if I can get this out, let's see what we got here. Bag in a bag again. Let's get this out. Oh. This one says, I just want to drink coffee, save animals, and take naps. Right? Both my pit bulls are rescues. I just want to drink coffee, which is something I do nonstop every day, save animals, and take naps. Naps are a highly underrated activity. Do you know that? Regardless of what age you are, you will always benefit by taking at least a 20-minute nap Sometime midday between like 12 and 2, try to grab 20 minutes. You'd be surprised what it does for you. But yeah, this spoke to me. Obviously, I love to take a nap. I take a nap every single day. Even though I'm retired, I still take a nap. All right. Last one, I think. Yeah, last pin. This one was 44 cents. And for 44 cents, someone of my generation is definitely going to um, know what this is about. And huh, this is basically a bra on fire, and it says, it's lit. All right, so in my generation, we went through the bra burning, where it was part of our protest, being hippies and whatnot. But when I saw this, 
this was perfect. All right. It's a picture of a little pink bra with flames and it says it's lit. <laughs> and I'm still a fan of not wearing one of those. Um, all right. The bag is getting smaller, but we still have a long ways to go because we still have 19 rings and seven sets of earrings to go through. And these may or may not come out in any particular order. So you see what you see when you see it, right? Okay. A dollar seven. This is a ring. And get this open. Oh, bag in a bag. Well, you know, I do like the bag in the bag because it keeps it very secure. And that's okay by me. This one is a really pretty blue. Let me see which finger did I order this one for. I think, hold on, let me take off the rings that I was wearing today so I can use my fingers. All right. So, yep, this one was ordered for my ring finger. There you go. It's a beautiful shade of blue. It's almost, um, it's not a turquoise. It's it's not a peridot. It's definitely not an aquamarine. It's just a really pretty blue. And it's got little crystals on the sides. I don't know if you can see those, the little crystals on both sides. It's got a thin band, all right, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Just a nice bright blue. I tend to go with the light blue when I'm looking at blue stones simply because uh, my birthday's in March. And that's an aquamarine stone. It doesn't always have to be aquamarine, but it helps. All right. And this one is a dollar eighteen, thirty-two cent price adjustment. So I ended up only paying eighty-six cents for this. Another ring. Come on out. <laughs> Okay, this ring, I do plan on blinging it out. It's just a very basic, and I did, oh, I ordered this a big one. Did I, which finger did I order this for? One, okay. So this is just a very plain silver brocade type ring. Can you see all the little nooks and crannies in there? A little heart in the middle, all right. What I'm going to do with this is I am going to set some crystals into spots on this ring and really bling it up. It was very, very plain, but for the cost for less than 50 cents for this, all right, definitely worth it. Next, 87 cents. And this is a set of three. I'm not going to do anything with this other than wear it. These are in rose gold. First, you have a little tiny, almost squared off ring. Look at that. Isn't that precious? All the bling halfway down the sides on each. All right, with the crystals. Let's slick that. I don't even remember what finger I ordered these for. I don't know. I'll put it on my ring finger for now because that's where it's going to be for a while. All right, and then it also comes with this beautiful twist band. All right, and as you can see, it's just got all the different twists and the sparkles that go around it. It's got three twists to it, four twists, excuse me, four twists, all right? So I'm gonna stack that one with this. And I love the stackables because you can mix and match and put them in any order that you want. And then this one is a really tiny, tiny, fine band, really fine band. Look at that. Let's see how close we get, there we go. Just a couple of little crystals in different spots. All right. Again, these are all in the rose gold. So together, they make up the set. Really pretty. I actually really, really like it. I didn't put them on in the order that I should put them on to wear them. Let me see if I can just flip them around. That might make a difference. But there we go. All right. So I love the stackable rings. Very beautiful. Very pretty. Rose gold, lots of glitter, lots of bling. Excellent. Very, very nice. All right, what's up next? 41 cents, and I don't know what's in here. Pair of earrings, 41 cents. Come on out. All right, these earrings are for my business, my jewelry business that I have. And these are, these are already blinged out, but I will be hanging a pearl or something down in the center uh, of these to dress them up a little bit. Hold on. Got them all twisted here. There we go. All right. Beautiful, just beautiful crystals. Look at that. Bling, 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 bling. 
Very gorgeous. Very nice crystal work on these. They're a decent size. They're about an inch or so. I will be hanging like a pearl or maybe even another gemstone down in the center of them to increase the beauty of them. They're, be they're beautiful as they are, um, but I know my customers, my clients, they do like things a little bit up a notch. Okay, what we got next? 89 cents. Oh, this is another pin. I don't know how this got mixed up. Huh. Oh, gosh. Are you a Harry Potter fan? Because I definitely am. I have not read the books, but I have watched every movie more than once. And there's some things that uh, <laughs> I can relate to. This pin says, I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. I love this. And this is obviously is a Harry Potter thing, but this saying is just so me. So I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. I waited and waited and waited for this thing. This particular pen pin kept going out of stock. It was getting sold out all the time. I waited over a month for it. And I'm glad I did because when it came back in, it came in at a good price. So I'm a happy camper. All right, next item. This was $1.34 and I'm okay with that price. Um, I really don't think I'm going to do anything to them, but the reason that I didn't mind paying for, well, I will be changing the hooks because if you can see these kind of hooks all right these are not the most secure right here where it just sits on there if this gets caught in my hair when my hair is down i'll be losing the earring but this is what they look like they're just a moon with a blue crystal and like a teardrop on the bottom that doesn't have any crystals in it but they're really really pretty um i don't know if i'm going to enhance them or not but these are for me these are not for the business so we'll see what happens. Um, but I absolutely love these. They're very lightweight. I definitely, as I said, I definitely will be changing the hooks. And I would recommend that anytime you get something that has one of these hooks that you change it. This one's on backwards. It's another reason to change it. Okay, there we go. So yeah, definitely really, really pretty. Very lightweight. The whole thing from the top of the hook where it'd be in your ear to the bottom is about two inches. So it's not a super long dangle. All right. But it's very lightweight. Very, very pretty. Absolutely love those. All right. Let's see where we're at. Well, we're doing pretty good. It's only 32 minutes. I think we might actually come in under an hour if we're, if we're lucky. <laughs> this was $1.98, but this is three pairs of earrings. And why can't I find a little thingy to open this? Oh, there it is. All right. Three pair. Oh, forget it. Come here, Charlie. Oh, that's one way to get them out. <laughs> Excuse me. Huh? I'm back. Did you miss me? Was I gone that long? All right. I really made a mess out of these. Hold on. These went flying. Good they're not fragile. Okay. So for under $2, three pairs of earrings. And these are all patinaed. All right, and brass and with the faux uh, turquoise in them. So three different pairs. For you've got this little pair of leaves that has a little star and a little heart in it. And they almost just shape like a heart as well, right? And then you've got this pair in the center, which has the little hanging thing on it. So I like these. And then this patina pair on the end, which are a little bit bigger. All right, so these are all going to go into my business. I don't know if I'm going to do anything with them or not, but for three pairs for that price, I cannot complain. That's definitely a business item. And I ruined the bag, so I can't put them back in the bag. All right, let's see what else we got down here. We are fishing into the bag, the bigger bag. And we have a ring. Oh, okay. This was $1.28. I don't know if I got a price adjustment on this or not. I don't think I did. Um, but this ring, I did get, oh, yes, I got a full refund on this. As soon as I looked at this to price it, I could see that the back of the ring, okay, if you look in the purple in the corner, it has a chip missing. There's a chip in the corner, and it's not seated properly in the ring itself. So I do have big stones like this. This one is dark purple, right? It has just a little bit of bling on the side. Can you see those few little stones there? 
It has a few little stones on the side right down here. But when I spotted the chip, it was it's pretty noticeable and that it's not seated properly. I contacted Timu and Timu said, give you a full refund, keep the item. We don't care. You don't have to return it. So what I will do is I will fix it. I will either replace the stone or I will repair the setting and uh, make sure that that's taken care of so that it can be worn or it can be donated. All right. Here is another ring. This was 69 cents with a four cent price reduction. So I paid 65 cents for this. I actually really love this ring. I have a pair of earrings that I got from Timu that um, match it. The earrings that I got from Timu are a leaf. They look just like this part of the ring, all right? But this ring is like, oh, this is a pinky ring, I forgot. All right, and this one is, it's adjustable simply because of the way it wraps around your finger. So I can actually put it on any finger that I wanna put it on. But this is what it looks like. It's just a nice leaf crystal wrap around your finger, double leaves, all right, thin band. And because it's open here on the top, you can open it as big or as small as you want it, depending on what whatever finger that you want to wear it on, all right? All right. You can even wear it like on the top of your finger if you wanted to wear it like that, all right? But that's an absolutely gorgeous ring. It does match the earrings. So I can see where that would be great. Can't complain for the price. I'm very happy with that. All right, next ring, 97 cents with a, hold on a second here. I don't know what's going on with my computer. I think we're okay. All right, 97 cents with a 10 cent price reduction, 87 cents for this ring. If you see anything you like in here, Please just drop me a note down in the comments and I will be happy to give you the link. Uh, this is not sponsored by Timu. Everything I'm showing you here is out of my pocket. I know in the beginning I said that Timu has invited me, but I have not begun yet. When I do, I will let you know um, and you know, I will specify that it's sponsored or not sponsored. But right now this is unsponsored. This is all me. All right, so this is a mood ring and it came out black. But as you can see, the minute I hold it up to the light, it's changing colors. So I'm going to put it on and we'll see what it does color wise. I did not download uh, what the different colors mean. So I really don't have a clue, but we'll see what happens. I'm going to wear it for a while and see if it changes. Right now, when I look at it, it's starting to get like a royal blue. If anybody knows what royal blue means, let me know. Um, but I will have to go on the website and figure out what that is. I just thought it was very pretty. It's got such a simple little design. Let me show you. It's just a simple little design on the side. Very inconspicuous. Nothing big. Nothing really stands out about it. All right. It's just a cute little non-obtrusive little ring. So I thought that was absolutely precious. Oh, yeah, it's totally a royal blue right now. Totally blue. Okay. Next item, another ring, 87 cents. I was not going to get this ring initially because I don't like rings that look like engagement rings. But I figured if I don't wear it on that finger, on the, the left hand ring finger, then it shouldn't be an issue. But I just, you know, the price went down on it. I thought it was nice. So I said, why not? This is really sturdy ring. All right, look at that ring. Can you see that? Look at that center stone. Its center stone is round, but everything else around it is square. It's got all the crystals down the side. I'll figure out how to do this where it won't glare. Turn my light a little bit, maybe. All right, there we go. It's got all the crystals down the side. Big stone in the middle. It sits a little high. You can see how it sits up like this. More crystals down this side. Uh, it's just very well made, very sturdy, medium sized band. Um, it does fit that ring finger. And if you look at it closely, it does look like it could be an engagement ring. Um, but that's OK. I, you know, if, if I'm engaged, leave me alone. I've heard uh, another YouTuber say that all the time when she wears one of the rings. Just, she goes out and I'm like, well, you're never going to catch a man if you're wearing that on your finger. So you got to make sure that you wear it on another finger. But I think it's absolutely beautiful. Look at this. Look at the glitter on this thing. I mean, could you, from a distance, you wouldn't be able to tell that this ring was around a buck, right? 
I love that. Okay. This was 99 cents with a one cent price reduction. Hey, every penny counts. When it comes to team moves, you know you can get stuff for three cents, four cents, six cents, five cents. So save those pennies. Why not, right? Um, the price adjustments, those are totally up to the vendor that's selling you the item. They determine the cost based on, you know, their popularity. I mean, it's, it's all supply and demand. So one guy might have this ring for a couple of cents. Somebody else might have it for a couple of dollars. But this is a basic band. I absolutely love this. Let me take off the mood ring for a second. Bear with me. I'm going to put this one on. This is just a gold and silver wrap band. That's all it is. Just gold and silver. Can you see the little gold X's? There you go. And then the two stones in between each, each X. And it's the same pattern all the way around the ring. All the way around. It has the gold X's and the two stones. The gold X and the two stones. All the way around. Very simple little ring. Does it go with that one? No, it doesn't. But it fits on the finger with it. <laughs> So that's really nice. I like it. It's very, it's, it's simple. But it's pretty. Right? It's a very simple ring. And again, because it's so thin, it can be stacked with any other of my stackable rings. Okay, ring number whatever. I don't even know what we're at. This was at 89 cents. And for 89 cents, this is one of my favorite color stones. These are like peachy or citrine color stones. I have other rings that look similar to this. Look at that. Is that not absolutely gorgeous? Can you see that? I don't know why I'm getting such a shadow. Hold on a second. Let's do this. There we go. All right. Absolutely gorgeous. Citrine color. Light peachy orange color. It has stones on either side of it. See how close I can get without it going out of focus. It has stones on either side of it that have that same color. One here and one on this side. One there and one there. Right, and then the big center stone, and then little glitter and design on both sides of this. Right, so this is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely love that ring. You can find so many different colors, so many different styles, everything from steampunk and goth to very traditional and old fashioned and elegant and things that look like this, like fancy wedding rings. All right, 99 cents with a penny price adjustment. This one is similar setting to the one I just showed you, but this is all red. Every stone in here is a blood red color. All right, I don't know if you can see this. All red, all the way down the sides, the main stone, that side, it's all blood red. Hold on a second. Oh my goodness. Lighting, lighting, lighting. Issue, issue, issues. All right. So it's a lot darker than I thought it would be when I saw it online, but it's still a beautiful shade of red. There we go. Look at that. Red stones on both sides of it. So the whole ring is all red. And again, it's true to size. I've mentioned in the past that if you buy a ring that has a thin band on the bottom, that you want to go true to your ring size uh, for whatever finger you want to put it on. If you buy a ring that has a wider band, you're going to want to go up at least a half size because the wider band, of course, is not going to stick in the crook of your finger. It's going to come up a little bit where your finger is bigger. So ergo, bigger ring means bigger size. All right, this one was 97 cents. This is just a cute little two stone ring, right? It's just got two stones on it. It's got a purple one and like a, a green color, like a peridot. All right, if you can see that, purple and green. Purple there, green. And then it's got little crystals in between each of those. So it's got three crystals and the two. And this again, true to size. And because it's thin, it can be a stackable ring. It can definitely be a stackable ring. I don't know what's going on with my light today, but this thing, I had it working, and now it's deciding to, it's going to do whatever it wants to do, right? 
I don't know. We'll find out. Okay, anyway, let's keep going. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, this is another ring. Okay. This one was 59 cents with a four cent price adjustment. So we're looking at 55 cents. Hold on a second, please. Okay, that was a quick second, right? I hope. Um, all right. So for 55 cents, we can't get it out of the bag. You know, they wrap these things up like they're gold, and I'm kind of glad that they do. I never worry about losing any of these things unless I leave it in the bag myself. This is just another plain band, but it's got that same twist that the other band had. So they're going to look great stacked together. Um, this one has a twist, however, that goes all the way around. The entire ring has that same twist. You see, it goes all the way around, and there's crystals all the way around that. Look at that. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? All the way around it. Fits true to size. Okay, again, it's considered a thin band, but it's very, very blingy. Crystals everywhere, right? And again, a stackable. Um, as you notice, a lot of the rings in here I consider to be stackables because they're very thin in nature. So I can mix and match any combination that I want. See, I just reached in and grabbed three rings and I can put any combination on those. I can mix and match them on any finger that I want. So think about doing stackables um, when you're looking for jewelry. It's, it might be an option for you, I don't know. 88 cents, this one had a 23 cent price reduction. Came in at 65 cents for this ring. Well, I tell you, you can't beat these. And no, all this jewelry did not come in one order. Uh, it come over the course of several, and I just kept setting it aside until I had enough to do a jewelry haul. Uh, I would never spend that much in one order. All right, this one, again, is the type of twist. This is rose gold, all right, with the silver bling. You can see that. Probably looks better if it's not on my finger. My fingers are very swollen today. All right, so rose gold with a double row of gemstones. Can you see all the bling? And it's just got a twist, almost like an infinity type thing, like a figure eight infinity. Love that combination. And again, it's going to be a stackable because of the shape of it. Oh, we're getting down to the bottom of the bag. Let's see if I can get everything out of this bag. I think we've got about maybe 10 things left, if even that. All right, bag's empty. Let me set that bag over there. This is, what is this? 43 cents for this ring. 43. How come we can't see that? There we go. 43 cents. <laughs> 43 cents. Okay. Oh, this is fun. All right. So this one is, obviously, this is another twist ring. Obviously, you could tell my finger is not going to fit in there. But this is a twist ring that you can open up to whatever size your finger is. This is a peacock. Excuse, is it a peacock? Yes, this is a peacock. All right, so my plan is to, on his tail, is I am going to put some different little pieces um, and kind of bling him up a little bit, all right, to make him look a lot more like a peacock. But I don't know if I can get him on my finger. I didn't really open it up, but I'll do it this way. There we go. So he can be worn on any part of your finger. But yeah, I'm going to be blinging Mr. Peacock out. I'm going to put something in his eye so his eye stands out. He has a little, looks like a little pink stone in his eye. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see how close I can get. Yeah, he has a little pink stone, but he doesn't have anything else in his tail. And peacock tails should always have something in them. So this one will go into the business um, simply because it's very unique and it needs some extra stonework. And I'm pretty sure because it's adjustable um, that it'll be popular. All right. So I wrote all over this one. This is 97 cents. However, it should have been ocean blue. It came in a very dark color. The ocean blue they were showing online was a real pale, almost like an aquamarine type blue. 
So I contacted Timu right away and I said, whoa, uh, this is definitely not the color as shown. It wasn't even labeled the same color. This one is labeled sea blue. And on the website, it's labeled as ocean blue, two completely different colors. So this one will go into the business too. This is just no frills, nothing on the band. All right. Just a big square blue stone. It's so much darker than what I wanted. I really don't like darker blues. So this one I'll put into my business. I might put a stone or two on the side just to bling it up because it doesn't have anything. But it's really, really dark compared to what it shows on the on uh, the website. The website shows it as being very pale, almost so pale that it's see-through. Um, but Timu said, you know what? No problem. Keep the item. And they gave me a full refund. I didn't have to return it. All right, what do we got? Earrings, earrings, earrings. Oh, there's another ring. This is mostly rings in case you couldn't tell, but there are earrings in here. All right, this was $1.88. $1.88 for this ring. I thought this was cute. This is a little tiny red ring with a little bit of bling around the stone and on both sides of the stone. I don't know if you can see. Let me see if I, sh there we go. If I shade it a little bit from the light. It's got three stones on one side. Okay, again, if you can see these, three stones here, the red stone in the middle, and it's a very vibrant red too. Look at that, almost like a fiery red. And then it's got three stones on this side. So it's absolutely beautiful ring. Love that. Again, it's a thin band, fits true to size, all right? I prefer, because of the things I do, I prefer to wear my rings on my ring finger. I do have other rings so that I can do my whole hand um, if I'm dressed that way to do something like that. But And again, I have very high acidity in my system. So if you do, or considering that these are not even 925, take a little bit of clear nail polish, top coat, base coat, whatever, and just very lightly, not heavy because it'll never dry, very lightly coat the inside of this, all right? Let it dry. It will keep your finger from turning black. I had these two Timu rings on all day long, and my fingers, and I mean 12 hours, my fing ring fingers have nothing black on them. No marks, no discoloration, nothing, all right? So it works like a charm to do that. Just You just have to make sure that you actually do it. All right, what do we have left? One more ring and the rest is earrings. All right, last ring, I believe. This was $1.34. And I'm okay with it being $1.34. These are royal blue stones. Can you see these? Look at these. These are royal, very, very deep royal blue stones on a silver band. There's the blue showing up. Again, a stackable ring because it's narrow. Oh, no, this is a pinky ring. Yep, this was a pinky ring. All right, so royal blue. Very simple, but very pretty. Very, very nice. All these are great quality. I'm really happy with these. Okay, earrings. This was 98 cents with a nine cent refund, or nine cent price adjustment, I should say. 89 cents I paid for this. Slice it open. These are pretty simple. I'm sure I don't throw any parts away here. These are just little hoops with a little turquoise bead on top, a little faux turquoise. The hoop hangs this way. So from the side, you see the hoop like this, but from the front, of course, you see the hoop like this. But it's got the little turquoise bead on top. There's a little bit of design in the hoop, and the hoop is free spinning. All right, there's the hoop. These are posts. I don't use those clear rubber backs that they send with them. I actually use the backs that are better quality. So that's what these, these earrings are. They're very, very simple. These are for me. These are not for the business. Um, but I probably will add something to them. I might add more turquoise. Um, onto the hoop. I just might do a little something different 
you know, to make them stand out a little more. Though I do like just the plain silver like that. There's nothing wrong with that, right? All right. Another pair of earrings for me, 98 cents. 98 cents for this pair. Slice it and dice it and get them open. Almost done, guys. We're at 55 minutes, so an hour is perfect. Okay, these again are very Southwestern in nature, and these are for me. These have just simple faux turquoise in them, and they look like they have little arrowheads with little designs on them. So very simple, but very nice. Really, really like them. And you can see they do catch the light. They're not super long. They're about an inch and a half, maybe two inches tops from the very top of the, the wire here to the bottom. But very lightweight also. And the faux turquoise is a good quality. These are well made. And you can see here they're heavy. They're not hollow. They're not tinny. You can see how they're pressed in the back. All right, that's a sign of a you know good quality costume jewelry. So very happy with those. Okay, oh, we're getting down there. Two more things. 78 cents for this. 78 cents. Let's get this open without catching anything, including my finger. Oh, my goodness. The weekend is almost over, but, you know, being retired, weekends don't matter to me. Every day is a weekend. Every day is a work day, depending on what I decide to do. These are for me, however, I am going to put crystals or stones of some sort in these. These are just too gorgeous not to bling them out even more. These are just big hoops. Look at those. You can see the pattern and you can see clearly where I would be able to put little stones in, in some of these like little circles, even these little two circles down here all the way around, bling them out with a little bit of crystals, maybe some turquoise, maybe some different colored turquoise. Um, not sure. It, it depends. Well, I, I'll look at my supplies and I see what I have, but these are great. They're very lightweight, but they're very sturdy. They are very, very well made. All right. The, these are definitely for me, and I'm going to have a little fun taking them up a notch. I, you know, I do tend to wear everything as it is at first, and then I decide what I want to do with it. Um, I have to wait for it to speak to me. So, all right, last item. This is the end of the jewelry for now. There is more coming, but I'm not going to hold it for jewelry haul. I'll probably just do it as it comes in. Um, following this... There'll be at least two, if not three more videos. I have another huge bag of household items, miscellaneous household stuff, uh, kitchen, bath, air conditioner, all over the stuff. And I also have two products that I won playing the game Farmland, uh, which costs nothing to play on your phone. I didn't send any invitations. I didn't have to order anything. I didn't have to spend any money to do it. I just did what I normally did on Timu, and I earned my um, food, so to speak, to water the plants. I ordered won my order, and it took about two weeks, but I did win a personal desktop air conditioner worth, I think it was like $15 or $18, and a beautiful blouse worth about the same. So I got... $35, $40 worth of items for free just from playing a game. So go, if you're new, go download the app, get yourself set up, and then type in Farmland and Fishland. Play those two games. Get started with it. They give you at least a month to try to win something. Um, so, And you get to pick what you want to win. They give you a whole selection of stuff to pick from. It took me like an hour more to figure out what I want. And I was floored when I won and they sent me the thing and then boom next thing I know it was like four days later my prizes were shipped completely separate from any of my other orders they came together in one bag so I'm thrilled with that um okay dollar 67 it was a dollar 69 little two cent these are haven't seen anybody else haul them but that doesn't mean they haven't I just buy these and I said you know what I am about 20% Native American on my mom's side. And I didn't have any white earrings. So I got these. Hold on. These are all dish kebabulated. I don't want them to get tangled and come apart. 
They're big, but I like big earrings. Look at these big, giant feather earrings. All right, they've got white up here in the top. Let me take them off the board. I'll take one off the board. It'll be easier to see. Okay, so they have like a little white pearl hanging up here in the top. They have decorative design. They have the white inlaid enamel all the way around this ring. Then they have the crystal beads, the metal feathers hanging down, crystal beads, and then the white feathers. And they're absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely love those. Look at that. Look at the detail in that. Can you see that? These are very well done. And for the price, I can't complain. They are long, all right? I would not wear them with what I'm wearing because you don't want to have a statement top on like this. This, this makes such a statement with these fancy um, shoulder straps that these earrings would get lost in it. So these earrings would go obviously with a darker color, like if I was wearing a black or a burgundy or something. But they are long. They're classified dusters but they're absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, guys, that's it. That's the end of the jewelry haul. Oh my gosh, an hour and one minute. <laughs> All right, so I'm not going to keep you long. Thank you for hanging with me. If you have any comments, please, I'm always open to feedback. I want to know how I'm doing. What did you like? Do you need any links for anything? Don't forget to get your price adjustments. And please, 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 because I am willing to be sponsored by Timu and I will always give you uh, an honest, accurate description of what I get when I'm sponsored by Timu. That's actually a clause that is in the agreement that I have to give an honest review, no matter what I think of the product. I just have to make sure that I'm, I'm being true to uh, my opinion and stating my opinion. So please smash that subscribe button. Help me get to 100 subscribers. I would love to be able to do that by the end of the month. So we have eight days, all right? That's only like 12 people per day, something like that, 12, 13, whatever. Um, just everybody just hit that button. Give me a big thumbs up. I will be back with a huge clothing haul, actually two clothing hauls, one of all tops, and the other will be... Uh, slacks, shorts, capris, nightwear, footwear, and the third video that I'll be doing will be, of course, the household. Thank you for hanging with me. Everybody who's come back, thank you for coming back. Everybody who's new, welcome, and I hope you return and come back and see more. All right, y'all stay sweet, stay out of the heat, and I will catch you soon.